what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. It's your girl Nunu the Hair Diva and I'm back with you with a two for one video. As quick as I possibly can, I am doing another shop my stash makeup look. I said, you know what, since I put on makeup for this video, I might as well go on ahead and do it as a shop my stash. It is also for a good friend here, Miss Nancy Goo Goo. If you do not know who she is, look in the description bar below. Click on her link. It will take you to her channel. She is a beautiful, lovely, lovely woman that I have truly enjoyed watching. Okay, so this two for one. We got the Shop My Stash video and we have the very first update on my 6 in 2016 so what I'm gonna do is do the shop my stash video first and then end it off with the 6 in 2016 so let me zoom in so you can see the makeup we have my forehead my brows my shadow lashes lower lash line Highlight, or is it? <laughs> Blush, and my lips. Ta da! All right, so quickly moisturize the face, put the eye drops on. I even put my eye cream under my eyes. I do not have any primer on because, like I said, this particular foundation I am trying without the primer. It is still the L'Oreal Infallible number 112 cocoa this is what that looks like but i mixed it with a item that miss nancy goo goo got me to buy here on the yt it is the philosophy take a deep breath and this is what it looks like it comes with the pump and it's only one color you can get this off your ulta website it is by philosophy and um as i look at myself i am seeing the glow mm -hmm. this particular color also worked well with the l'oreal infallible so i'm very glad to have that on all right since i didn't put on any primer i had the foundation on i mixed it with the philosophy take my breath away no facial powder none whatsoever however i do have some primer on my lids and i worked in the wet and wild fergie primer that is this one right here it is in clear i have that all over my eyes and i am going to uh just show you the palette the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, this is what I use. Now, without showing it to you, because a little bit has changed in here, it's also a part of my 6 in 2016, I use in the brow highlight for uh, white chocolate. My inner transition color is 2 Salted Caramel and Milk Chocolate. For my lid color, I use hazelnut. And for this burst of color right in the middle, I use cream brulee. Now, the only reason why I'm not showing it to you because this is a part of my 6 in 2016. And you will see it uh, towards the end of this video. For the blush that is on my face, I went on and used my third Wet n Wild color icon blush this is in pearlescent pink and this is what that color looks like and for my liner i am using the la girl 
a pro gel liner it is in this choco gray the concealer I'm going backwards the concealer that I use for my brows and for my face is the LA girl pro concealer this is in the color toffee my brows I use two pieces it is the last of this Nika K uh, lip pencil in Coco and I also use this cargo shadow that was given to me by uh, brown eyes girl Sharice it is a cargo shadow and this is in the color Columbia the mascara that is on my eyes I'm still using the stretch X mascara in black and I have a two-piece on my lips I am using the ColourPop and Limbo. Very pretty. And because I didn't want it to be too mattifying, I pulled out a lip gloss you haven't seen me use in a while. It is the Urban Decay Naked Lip Gloss. This is in, I might have to put my eyeballs on, so let's see, because I can't see <laughs> what it says. It is in freestyle, and hopefully you can see that. Freestyle. And that is what the color looks like. So that is the end of the first part of the face of the day. I will show you my face one more time. You have the foundation mixed with the philosophy, take my breath away. Oh, take a deep breath. <laughs> you have my brows, my shadow, my lashes, and lower lash line. You have a little bit of a highlight effect, the blush, and my lips. Ta-da! All right, so to keep this video not so long, if this is where you want to click off, I truly appreciate you for sticking with me to the end of the very first part of the video. The second part of the video is my 6 and 2016 update. What that is, I picked six items to try to use up within this year. I believe I did my very first video in December. I will link that below if you haven't seen it so you can see the item and hear my reasons why I wanted to um, use them up what I have here is a paper that I saw a brown-eyed girl Sharice use It's pretty much showing uh, when I started each individual item and the initial length of each item and then the second time I actually took a I want to say um, I can't, I got a brain fart right there. The second time that I outlined the lippies and everything to show you how much I have used. So what we have here are the lipsticks and I started them in November of uh, 2015. And these are actually the lipsticks as they got on the paper. I do have one that I will, that I removed and I will show that to you. <laughs> I was just red for a few minutes. Okay, so the very first video was November 27th. This video is for February 27th. And what we have is number 445 on the mauve. Comes in packaging like that. This is what that color looks like. I will do a swatch right here. This is what that looks like. It is very shimmery and um, I don't like shimmer, I like matte. So the very first one, as you can see, the first line is when I initially started. The second line is on 2, 4, what did I do it? 2, 4, 16. And then what I do is I go to this little white part here at the bottom. And as you can see, I am still at that same marking for the second mark. So that is on the mauve. The next color is 450 Mauve Mania. Comes in packaging like this. 
this is what that color looks like this color I actually happen to like <laughs> using at work as you can see it's a little more satiny and not as frosty as um, on the mauve this is mauve mania right there here is the first initial line this is for February 4th and let's see if I turn it this way there you are so that goes to show you exactly where I am with that lipstick so I am using them all right the next color we have 750 bronze beam and it comes in clear packaging like that this is what that color looks like and here is a swatch for you this is quite frosty as well and that's what that color looks like 750 bronze beam is this third one here the first initial marking the second one for February 7th and let's see all right February 4th I meant and there you are to show you where I am so I like to use I pick up one or two and I like to use them at work pretty much as a lip balm I just lather it on <laughs> as much as I possibly can okay the uh, next one we have is 905 what color is this brazen berry comes in packaging like that and beautiful color brazen berry I will do a swatch for you let me just lower it so I don't break the bullet this is what that color looks like it is very pretty it is not necessarily a winter color but I want to try to use it up here is brazen berry the blue is the first initial time I marked it then you have February 4th and if I do it like this there you are you can see I am at the line there okay so those are the markings for February the next time you will see me actually do this video it will be for May uh, I wanted to try to not do it every single month so that I, it can give me time to use the lippies up the very last lippy I decided to take out of it it is number one thousand lavender voltage and lavender voltage was a limited edition comes in packaging like that and this particular color believe it or not is like a dupe for mac heroin and let me just lower it so i can show you that this is what that color looks like at the bottom and this was the initial swatch and as you can see it hasn't changed it's still at the top for the initial swatch that is because I have taken it out I want to keep it and use it uh, as the dupe for my Mac heroin if it is not considered a dupe for that please let me know but it definitely looks like it to me all right now final part of the six in 2016 we have the Too Faced chocolate bar palette I am trying to reach pan on one to all of these shadows in here so I'm going to quickly get my little thing here so that you won't be blinded and I'm going to bring it in really close just to show you what has been going on as you can see we have cream brulee there is a nice dent in there if I turn kind of catty corner you can see in hazelnut there's a little bit of a dent right there and the next one which is called hot or hot chocolate there is the beginning of a dent 
The main color that I like to use is milk chocolate, which is this one here. If I do it like this, you can see that I really use the upper part of it a lot. So it's kind of denting upwards, I should say. Something like that. <laughs> And what else? The next color that I see a little bit of denting is this color here, which is amaretto. So I haven't hit pan on any of these, but you guys know that I'm using it. I show it all the time in pretty much every Shop My Stash video. I use it as my main colors, my transitional colors, my everyday going to work colors and I blend in other shadows with it so this is just the update and I just want to say uh, thank you so much for sticking me to the end of this two for one video we had the face of the day shop my stash we also had the six in 2016 I do have some other items that I want to add to my six in 2016 However, what I will do is a separate video for that. I want to end this video by saying to all be blessed, wear your makeup, save your money, and Nunu will see you in a few days with the next video. Bye. Hey everyone, it's your girl Nunu the Hair Diva, and I'm back with you with one more video. This package came just as soon as I finished my previous video, and that was the ColourPop. And what this is, is a package called Crystal Katina. And I know you could possibly see my camera and the lighting in the background, but I'll try to hold it at an angle where you can see what everything is. It came in this manila folder, and I just wanted to have this here so you could see what type of packaging it came in. But like I said, it is called Crystal Katina. So I'm going to open this right in front of you. We got the little bow that we just took off. And this I got online. I watch a lot of different...